Well, as crazy as it seems, guys, uh, Nigeria properties are still being seized abroad. Recently, according to People Gazette, they released another property belonging to Nigeria. They said Chinese investors took over Nigeria guest house in Liverpool to sell it on eBay for 2.2 million US dollars. You know, that time they seized our three private jets. They released the official presidential private jet. They have about two private jets with them now. So we do not know the agreement. So that is to say, no matter where you run go as a country, you know one pay your debt. Eh? They will seize your property. I don't know see that they seize country, they seize other country property before. Now Nigeria was here ago. I don't know. Because they always find a way around it, but I don't know. But you don't expect to collect loan now or to bridge contract and not pay back. You understand? You have to pay back now. Now Chinese investors are collecting a Nigeria property. Now this house is on sale. It's for sale. And if you want to buy it, eBay. They will auction Nigeria federal government property for eBay for 2.2 million US dollars. Yeah. What an insult. What an high sum. Insult to the highest order. Ah, ah. Ah, wow. Well, they are, they are businessmen. Whenever they come to you that they want to do business with you, you have the responsibility. The responsibility as a government, as people representative, to do the best deal, to sign the best deal that will benefit your people. Just like that Ungu State uh, past governor, who signed a wrong deal. According to him, he said he mistakenly signed a deal with the Chinese investors. Abba now. Then I think that man should mistakenly be in jail. He said he mistakenly signed a deal to the dubious Chinese investors. Ah, okay, good and fine. Sir. You mistake, Abi. But you know, say, misappropriation of funds is also against the law. It's not only when you tifo, when you misappropriate it, it's bad deals, you are also liable for it. So I think in an insane country, this guy should accidentally be in jail. But we are called by Nigeria though. By Nigeria. We never even feed jail people, made their carry money kuro kuro. Now the one made them misappropriate funds. Eh? Now we want to uh, sign bad, bad deals. Now we want to put for jail. It's highly impossible. Well, USA to the rescue, guys. USA just decided to give uh, Nigeria 27 million US dollars humanitarian aid package. Him, the hardship in Nigeria. USA, okay, let us liberate these people so that they give us 27 million US dollars. That is about 43.2 billion Naira. That is like two ministry, mini ministries budget. Now USA they give uh, Nigeria. We don't know if it's going to come in cash, bank, or na humanitarian aid. You know the USA if they say humanitarian aid, they know they give money sometimes. So he said that they go buy uh, mosquito nets, or they go buy. Uh, um, some, uh, I don't know whether that food stuff, medical things, and so many other stuff to give. But the total worth of the package will be 27 million US dollars. So we do not know. But then again, she you that see, say, in this world, the priority in, in this world is war. Humanitarian. Poverty. Mm, I don't mean anything. Food, no day. I don't mean anything, but whoa. If they say tell you, I'm not saying USA is liable to assist Nigeria for anything. No, I'm just saying that. Just check the budget for Nigeria, 27 million US dollar for humanitarian, and check the budget for postage of equipment for war. Billions of US dollars. But then again, I am not saying no, that the USA are liable. I'm just expatiating the whole matter. So because Percy Otto say, ah uh ah, -uh, 
People want to give you an aid again. You know, they tell them how they want to give you an aid and how they spend their money. No, it's not about that. I'm just expatiating it. So let's move past uh, politics. And uh, I want to share you a video of a man who discovered that his son, that he has been footing his bill in his house, is a millionaire. And you will not expect how this man reacted to this. I promise you, if you don't want your phone hack. Hello, good evening. Thank you for calling Navy Federal Bank. This is Charles speaking. How may I help you? How you doing? Um, I have some questions. How, I want to see my like account balance. Okay, can I have your uh, first and last name and the last four digits of your social security number? The DC is R. Harris and the last four digits of the social is And you're interested in seeing your balance. Yep. Okay. Okay, I see here your current balance is $1,564.10. Yep. Right. Sounds good, right? Wait, hold on. How much you say? How much you say? Say, wait. One, 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 say one that million. again? One million. Five hundred and sixty-four dollars. Wait, wait. You said one million. He said one million. Yeah, that sounds. He about said that. a whole. That's a million. And, and some change. Right? Yo, nah, you kidding me? Yo, yeah. listen, was, nah, was, 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 a million. You got a million? Like you chill. Bro. But you got a million still in my house, and I still pay your car note. Hello. Wait, you, you wait. Time out. Time out. Time out. Yes. Time out. Hold on. Time out. You mean to tell me you got a million? No, 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 I don't fuck that. You got a million dollars? No, no, sir. I'm talking to you. You got a, you got a million dollars? You heard, you heard. And I'm still paying your car note? And you don't pay no bills in here? I'm, what are you doing? What are you talking about? Hey, hold on, hold on. You mean to tell me you got a million dollars? Can I get a PC? Where you get that from? What? YouTube, all the business I've been doing. Yo, he, this kid got a <laughs> Your wife calls her say, yo, if that me will lie, wait time will do that boy. Just imagine, you are going out every day, they grind, they grind to pay bills for your family. Hmm? They pay bills for your family. They food, they pay their school fees, everything on your head. Then you just saw your child account number, who is a content creator, and you see like a 1.5 billion naira. And meanwhile, your account don't even get 500k. And this guy, they under your roof. They chop your food. They chop your food. What do you go do as the father? The way I go take drives you come for that, say, eh? Uh, or I will, I, I, it's a pay I say, okay, calm down. I will find a way. Of, uh, oh, yeah. Uh, you, you need to start paying some bills, you know? You get one car, me, I won't buy. You understand? You need to buy them now. You understand? <laughs> Man, wait till I go do that boy. Wait till I go do that boy. Kai. So, but that wickedness though. That wickedness. But I believe the guy want me father know. That's why I decided to do the video. Just to see how his father will react. But me, I will be disappointed, man. Like, uh, you know, go allow me to pay so much bills, man, and you are not assisting them. Uh, I know it's my responsibility to take care of you to a certain age, or you don't vary the age. But that doesn't mean if God will bless you, you know, go leave that responsibility for me a, a, a little bit. No matter how young you are, as long as you are making money legitly. In fact, if you should be making money legitly, I should even be involved. Maybe at the age of 16, you should have confided in me as a father to tell you, see, it's because you, you, you don't trust me. I will be, I will think many, many things. So apart from the money aspect, I will think about trust. I will think about the family value. And so many things. Like I will start asking myself, eh, what have I done wrong? Like where did I ever go wrong? May I, my picking not trust me enough to tell me? I will start thinking many things, so, honestly. But... That is it, and uh, just to end this video as well, there's this other video I want to share about uh, one particular barrier. Of course, you can see the video of the barrier. You saw how everybody was wearing black, celebrating it as if they're a nightclub. In Africa, or in Africa, in Africa. It's good to celebrate life. 
there are some people eh, who have lived their life well. Uh, good family, uh, no hatred, nice family, good family background, love, prosperity everywhere. You know, you celebrate life. Celebrate life. But then again, the only thing, the only time I go ever in my life, eh? accept this kind of barrier, may understand this kind of barrier, is when maybe that person may die. It's above 80 years. And not just die. It is, the person is fulfilled. You understand? Because the party was just too much. Eh? No matter what, if I, know even, I cannot tolerate it. But I can tolerate it for other people. But in my family, I can't. Because on that day, we are meant to pray happy for that person, pray for that person, so that the year after will be good for that person. But I bet you, with that kind of party, man go the look of what girl yash may go knock that night. Fornication go happen. They go smoke it both here. They go do many, many things. And I just pray all those lavish uh, 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 barrier. That involves immorality. And I just pray the sins don't in a way also go to that person that they are bearing head. I just pray that person they are bearing doesn't commit any sin. It's just on those people who are celebrating, who decided to celebrate better like that. Well, we don't see many better. I mean, past this one, that, but come on, man. The br okay, let me just uh, end the video. Me, I not talk too much. So I can't catch you next time. Have a wonderful day. Stay blessed. Peace.